Oh, well, minus Fox Nine. So they can have it, Fox. FYI, I'm trying this a little bit differently because I'm trying to use OBS a little bit. Probably do these for the reactions and for my other stuff. Hopefully, I'll do better. But in any case, um, this is the new trailer for Bumblebee, and I'm gonna do a Lego movie. Probably be a second video, probably. But um, this is either for Bumblebee. Like someone literally just told me about, it. and Bumblebee probably one of my fa more favorite of the Michael Bay Transformers. Um. I do, he was one of my favorites, and I was kind of happy to see that, like, you know, cool, he's going to get his own movie when they talked about it, but then also, like, I'm hoping Michael Bay isn't a part of this, that way they could actually get some good writing in here, um, but in any case, I just get into this, see this, and see if they do Bumblebee, one of my favorite Transformers as well. Alright, let's begin, three, two, one. I'm really hoping this comes out good. Again, this is more of a test, if anything, for this. Because I don't want to get sued. Let me tell you something, boy. Hmm, I like this. So we're gonna see how Bumblebee get, came to w Wiki's side, basically. That's how, like, how he first looked when he first looked like a regular bug. That's just terrifying. That's terrifying. That looks cool, though. Whoa, he's a lot smaller in this version. In his past years, I guess. I'm... S I like the design. Like, I'm not sure... It's, it's kind of like the original design, a bit more of... Like, well, in movie-wise, original design. But, then, like, they brightened up his yellow a little bit more, it looks like. Hey, it's... Wait, is that John Cena? Star screen! That looked cool! Fudge, that actually looks pretty epic. Alrighty. I like this. I feel like I'm gonna still do the separate camera next time because I'm I just I'm just realizing this is gonna be a pain if I get censored. But basically, I like this for a couple reasons. Let me see if I can hold on a second. Uh shut off phone. Um let me look up. Hold on. Let's see. Bumblebee Transformers. Not that one. Like, something compared to this here. Let me... Sh really? Really? You want to f*** me up like that? Alrighty. Well... Fine. You know what? Screw you. Uh, no. There we go. Yes. This one. Minimize. Minimize that. Thank you. See, compared to this, where, like, I like that this one, like, this, this is, I don't know, I'm sure this is the original design. I think this is more the, um, this is more the, uh, other, this is one of the other movies. Basically, unlike this one where it is, like, more, like, grittier looking they try to make him look i guess kind of quote unquote more kid friendly but more it's because of you know he's made of a bug this kind of buggy over just uh I believe it's a camaro that he is he's a punch buggy in this one which i like 
He looks, of course, smaller. And I like I just like the more rounder version of it and stuff. And it looks cooler, I think, other than this design. Also, let me see. Where is Star Screen? I like that also that it looks like they're adding a little bit at least more color into this. Because even Star Screen. Even Star Screen right here. At least I'm assuming this is Star Screen. Looks more colorful. It looks more kind of like the cartoons and stuff. I actually want to know. Is Michael Bay. Is Michael Bay a part of this? Close that. Uh, uh, let's see. Bumblebee. Is he a part of this or no? First trailer, John Cena's tra Transformers prequel. Uh, director Travis Knight. Okay, Michael Bay's a producer. All right, who did um Michael Bay to produce? He's producing, but does that mean how much of the creative force is he behind this? Because I really want to. Because let's see, Michael Bay, The Last Night. That movie sucked. Uh, sixteen percent. Jesus. Uh, okay, he's not. Okay, he's not a director this time. He's not a fucking director. Okay, I'm good with this. But um. But one, I, like, again, like, we're doing a prequel one, so we know that B's probably going to be alive, of course. But, um, I also do like that they kind of, even though, like, it looks like they're kind of going back, I think, like, maybe the 70s, maybe 80s. I think probably 80s, because 80s is a big thing right now. Also, this, this, this right here is terrifying. This right here is just terrifying. It looks like a dead skeletal face. But, um... I like this Bumblebee design. Smaller, because of course the punch buggy. He's a, he's a little bit smaller. And, um... I don't know. He just looks cooler. Probably just the rounder, more, like, kind of dingy. Not dingier, but brighter colors. Even Star Screen, which a big problem with the Michael Bay ones is that, like, all the... Tra all of the uh, Decepticons are all, like always gray you easily get them confused this on the other hand looks a lot better and i like that also i like that um bumblebee even gets oh i didn't even noticed that it one it, one his mask looks kind of like a hornet or i guess more like a bumblebee and then you also see like the honeycomb patterns in the um in the eyes that's actually really cool i like that bits um let's see Wait, is that, this looks like a different body, like, hold on, so let me just see if it can show me the, where the fudge, there we go, okay, yeah, so it looks like this is after he takes each, he probably looks like he's going to transform into something else, probably this is when he probably turns into the Camaro, Maybe, or no, 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 no. This looks like he transforms into, like, one of those, um... Because it looks like he's probably in some kind of... He looks like he probably turns into, like, a Jeep or something. From this front part. So he is going to go through, like, a transformation or two. Even though I really kind of like... I really kind of dig the punch buggy look. I love the... Basically, this is Herbie fully loaded Autobot style. <laughs> Actually, that'd be really funny. We <laughs> we have a connection. It's hurt. the fuck was that noise? Um... We have a connection that Herbie Fully Loaded is actually part of the Transformers universe. That's why he's alive. But, um... Of course, this is just a teaser trailer. But I really like this. This looks pretty epic. I want it... Because, again, like, this one, I like the... Mostly because all I can really harp on right now is the design. I love how the design, the eyes look way bluer to signify. Just seeing Starscream, which probably is going to be like the main, who's probably going to be like the main antagonist. Um, hopefully, like he, because he looks great. I don't know how the heck they're going to say that they turned into some gray monsters. Actually, if anything, this probably isn't actually Starscream. Now that I think about it, um. 
but I do really like this. I want to see how this is gonna go. How this is gonna come out though. I like. She's cute. Um. She's very pretty. Uh, let's see. Where is the um? Hopefully, this is a pretty good one. Hopefully, this will be a, a hopefully this will be the best Transformers. Cause again, the other ones. Even though me and my brother gave like kind of like the last night, even though we did, I believe we did make fun out of that. Like by God, like that was such false advertisement that goddamn movie. Um, but this, I really want to see this. This is a prequel I really want to see. And oh no, wait, what are the what are these saying? <laughs> a gentle tone, a throwback to the eighties. The most important, no Michael Bay. Thank you. Uh. John Cena. Um, time to reboot the franchise. Please, please. Uh. So Sh Shia isn't his best friend. Nope. Three thousand Decepticons dislike this. Ah, oh, but this looks good. This honestly has what feels like could be a really good movie uh, for at least a Transformers film. So. I'm hoping I'm hoping that's gonna I'm hoping that's gonna be a major part of this. I don't know. I told you guys think. Sorry again if like the thing looks a little weird. Every adventure has a beginning. I don't know. I really like this. And maybe it's just because I like Cause again, like I've said before, I love simplicity in a character design, but good simplicity, where they're immediately recognizable and looks awesome, but it's still simple, and that's exactly what this is this is exactly what this design for bumblebee is it's very simplistic in some regards it's not as chaotic as the other um vert as the other like michael bay versions this actually has a unique and nice look to it, it makes him distinct not saying the other bumblebees wasn't distinct or anything like that but um at least this one seems a little bit more better and even they even kind of fixed his size too making him short making him a lot shorter than um the other transformers i don't know but tell me what you guys think in the comments below thanks for watching sure as i've done links are on my face description on there somewhere tell me if you like this newer setup um uh, i don't know i think i'll go back to the other one if only because it gives me a little more editing freedom with these stuff but i don't know but anyway thank you for watching share my videos and we will see you later <laughs> That looked cool!